Hello and what's going on guys, Vector Gaming here, bringing you a player review on Gary Cahill. This is actually the first player review I've uploaded my, to my channel, and somebody did actually lend me their account so I could do the player review on Gary Cahill. This is not my team, but it's absolutely insane, it's worth so much, there's Aguero on the bench, but he's 78 pace, 65 dribbling, 60 shot, I think that's 85 defending, 58 uh, passing, 88 heading, he's 6 foot 2, my friend actually picked him up for 177k. So that was to be fair, that's actually quite cheap and how good he is in games, absolutely insane. His pace is look at look at his pace. Good nice chip back to the goalkeeper, but because of his pace, it's just unbelievable. He's so his pace is so much faster in game. Uh, in my opinion, he's actually the fastest centre back that I've used um, ever. He, uh, his downfalls, as you just saw there, was his passing. As you can see there, he actually brought it back with his heading because his heading is insane. And uh, if he makes a mistake, he can basically make up for it. That's what I'm trying to say. But if Royce, he can keep up with Royce. He's, he's, uh, Gary Cahill's pace, I think it's 79, I think I said a minute ago. I'm not 100% sure, but um, I'm pretty sure it's 79. And Royce's pace is 90 on 91 or something around there. So, con so considering he managed to keep up with him that much, it's absolutely unbelievable. Um, as you saw just there again, like the, uh, the pace... It's absolutely insane. He managed to keep the ball in using his pace. Um, he's probably the best defender I've ever used. He's obviously his team this season, and that kind of explains it. And the reason his passing is off is because it's a uh, fit like 58 or something. Obviously, so that kind of excuses the fact that his pace is so bad because it says it in his stats. But other than that, all of his other stats are overpowered in game and so much better than everyone else would think as you just saw there his pace he just got to the ball he always gets to the ball he's always in the right place right time and um, if you need him to be somewhere he will be there he just saw that he picked up the ball without uh, needing to run there later on he knew the ball was going to be there so he gets there without you needing to make him move there my rating is uh, very high for this type of player as you saw as you can see right now it's 9.1 out of 10 uh, so it was 78 pace actually, so it was even lower and he's that much faster in game. 88 heading, which is also absolutely insane. 85 defending, which is good because he's a defender obviously. 65 dribbling, uh, 60 shot, but you don't need shot when you're a defender obviously though, so that's a good thing as well. So 58 um, passing, that's not the best passing, but obviously, you know what I mean. 58 passing, as you can see on the left, they all his uh, strengths and weaknesses. He's 85 overall, I rate him 9 out, well, 9.1 out of 10. He's absolutely insane, go and pick him up. He's getting cheaper and cheaper. So anyway guys, thanks for watching, please rate and subscribe. I hope you enjoyed the video, leave a like, comment down below for more player reviews and everything. I'm Vectic and I'm out, peace.